Hey y'all, today is Tuesday. It is 3.52. I left work a little bit early because yesterday and today, yesterday I was doing my work at like noon. Today I was ready at like two o'clock, maybe like 1.30. So I've been leaving there early because what's the point of me staying when the work is done? You know what I'm saying? I'm salary, so ain't no milk in the clock <laughs> you know and plus like the night dispatcher she gets there at four she be late all the time no but that ain't none of my business so me leaving 10 minutes early ain't gonna hurt nobody anyways leaving work i should get home in like 15 minutes so 4 15 ish and i have an appointment at cvs at five to wow he didn't even stop that was dangerous I have an appointment at five to go get a flu shot. It would be so funny because I want to put out longer vlogs or whatever. But y'all know, especially lately, I have not been doing much, right? So these vlogs are drawn out over days and days and days and days. And I don't be remembering what I be saying on this camera. So I don't know if I told y'all I went thrift shopping this past weekend because I have some interviews coming up and week I had planned on like wearing my little cute outfits or whatever but yesterday I wore sweatpants and a t-shirt it was cute though I didn't go to work looking sloppy or careless how I always do I always go to work looking careless <laughs> and then today I have on this denim jacket I always wear with like this um dress I have on a dress today but I got on my Crocs so I really don't look like I did too much but it's a step up really from what I be normally wearing. I say all that to say, tomorrow when I just come in with these dress pants and I'm having a button up, they're gonna be like, <laughs> what, what, you, what, you, what you want, what you doing? So y'all, I think I wanna go to the thrift store. I just feel like you find some good stuff in there that you don't always find everywhere else. I know I can go to like TJ Maxx, Burlington and get like some nice stuff. I definitely can. But one thing about it, I feel like I always find a good blazer. A good blazer at the thrift store. I want to find me a blazer and that's pretty much it. Just trying to waste some time. But I really just want to check in, show my face and say hey. Let y'all know how the day went. It was okay. It was okay. They didn't stress me out. Hey, I always do. Oh, excuse me, but we made it through. All right, ladies and gents. Yo, we not even gonna go there. Just, <laughs> I don't even know what to say if I want to say something. Anyways, gotta get this shot at five, but it's four o'clock. So I don't know if I wanna go home and just sit around for about an hour or if I wanna go to a store, look around, I don't know yet. And I think the last time I talked to y'all, I think I talked to y'all on um, Saturday. I remember one of those days I was telling y'all that I wanted to do a um, a vision board, like an updated vision board. If I didn't, I want to do an updated vision board because the one that I made in December for 2024, like I've crossed off about 80% of what's on the board. So I'm super proud of myself. So I made another one and it's super cute. So I don't know. I love it y'all it's so crazy like it's cute but it's like every time I look at it I'm really I just been praying over it it's so crazy I just want everything to happen and I just been looking at it being so hopeful and just so excited about what's to come but whatever since I'm right here I might as well just go home I don't really need to spend no money they pissing me off hold on All right, child, let's do some quick grocery shopping. Thank you. You too. Hey, it's Thursday. Y'all, I am cramping. I don't know if that's CMI, but I am cramping so bad. Like, my stomach hurts. 
so bad. I've been cramping all day at work. Like, oh my God. It ain't even funny. It just hurts. Oh, that's a cute little dog. Okay. So I just got some Panda Express. Oh, I look gross. Oh, child. I just got some Panda Express. I'm about to sit in this parking lot and eat it. I have a doctor's appointment because my eczema has been eczema ing. <laughs> Oh my God. I feel like this about to take away my new car smell. It ain't gonna smell like a new car no more. But I'm hungry. And I still got 30 minutes before my doctor's appointment. But I just want to check in and say, hey, I also have a, um, a client today. That's why I really wanted to make sure that I brought my camera so I could remember to record. But y'all, my stomach hurt. Like, I want to cancel so bad. But I, I, I can't do it. I can't do it. I will not do it. I'm not going to cancel on my clients. But the way my stomach hurt, I hope this don't make it. It shouldn't because it's just like cramping. But like, I'm dang near scared to eat because I don't want my stomach to hurt even more. But this is dope. I got orange chicken, beef and broccoli, and fried rice. Diamonds, 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 diamonds on me dancing. What's up, y'all? Happy Friday. Happy Friday, y'all. Whew, thank God it's Friday. <laughs> I was praying since yesterday. I was like, God, Jesus. Thank God tomorrow is Friday. And I woke up today like, oh, Bless you, Lord. Thank God it's Friday. Yeah, I was done at my work at like 10 o'clock. So I've been just on a computer doing a whole bunch of nothing at work all day. Hold on, I think y'all moved a little bit. But yeah, I was done with my work at like 10 a.m. It's 3.24. Y'all know I really don't get out work until 4. I've been loving these days where I get my work done and I be like, I'm out of here. Okay, I got dressed up all cute for work. I got on these pretty pink slacks that I got from the thrift store last weekend. I was supposed to have an interview today, but I ended up um, rescheduling because it's Friday. Ooh, y'all keep moving. I had an interview today, but I ended up rescheduling it for a later date because I realized it was some things that I was supposed to bring to the interview and I didn't have them on me. <sighs> I would have been unprepared. And I could have left early. Um, the interview was for three o'clock. And my boss was giving the vibes as if he was finna stay. So my boss lives in Michigan and they always leave early on Friday. So he was giving the vibe that he was gonna stay all day. And I was like, I can't leave that early if he here. <laughs> so I ended up rescheduling really for that main reason. He ended up leaving early and I was like, dang, I could have went, but I'm not tripping. Everything happens for a reason. Feeling the whole like business casual attire, even though like my job is so dirty, like my shoes is dirty right now, but my outfit is still pretty clean. And I just when you go to work looking cute like this, you can go places after work, you know what I mean? I didn't do my makeup and everything, I didn't do no lashes though, because that's just doing too much for the job. But I don't know, it's like when you look cute for work, you can do stuff after work because most of the time. If I know like, or if I think I'm gonna do something, like say if me and my girls, we end up going like to lunch or dinner or something like that. After work, I gotta go home, change, all this other stuff. But like when you dress like this, you just ready for the day. Anyways, <laughs> I just want to check in. I was supposed to vlog when I did that pedicure yesterday, but y'all was cramping so bad. I and my client is funny because I told her, I said, I'm sorry, because you know, I had like a little pain. I said, oof, I'm so sorry, I'm cramping, you know, excuse me. She was like, girl, it's that time for me too, I understand. So she was in her fields, I was in my fields, and I was just trying to, I gave her a good experience nonetheless. I'm never gonna slack on, you know, giving the girls what they deserve and what they pay for, but I was ready to get in and out, okay? I was like, let's do this real fast. So I didn't pull the camera out, I'm sorry. I have no plans for this weekend. Unfortunately, I am so sorry. There's something going on like at this park by my house, so I might do that. May, may not, I don't know. If I do something this weekend, of course y'all will know. I'll bring y'all along, but I think it's gonna be 
be a pretty dead weekend and I need it to be a dead weekend because the way I need to finish this chemistry and this microbiology lab and I need to clean my room. Like I got clothes everywhere, y'all. It's crazy. But yeah, halfway home, I'll talk to you guys later. Whew. All right, y'all, it's hot. <laughs> So I just got a Goodwill. All I bought was like some jeans that I'm gonna have to take in in the waist. But all my jeans are from Fashion Nova for the most part. Like they're skinny jeans and different washes. But I'll probably show y'all when I get home. I just found a nice pair of old navy jeans. Straight leg, but they're like super high rise. But I feel like once I take in like the waist or whatever, they'll be really good. And I bought a blazer, which is really cute. I feel like it'll go with like a dressy outfit or I could dress up a casual outfit. So I got a pair of jeans and a blazer. Only spent $16. Water probably hot. It ain't. <laughs> it's 4.32. I guess I'll make my way on home. Cause y'all know the more I stay out, the more money I spend <laughs> and not gonna happen i'm going on vacation in two weeks i actually need to be saving some money and plus i know i'm going to go shopping for some unnecessary stuff probably next week or the week of so yeah but all right y'all i'll talk to y'all when i get home hello y'all and happy sunday gavin was behind me look like he just ran off somewhere oh there he is <laughs> But yeah, so I already been out. I went to the grocery store, I went to Walmart, and I went to Strack and Ventil. Got some groceries and like some house stuff. We needed soap and I needed some flashcards. I'll talk about that later, probably in the vlog. I don't know, whatever. Um, <laughs> Cause y'all know I've been school shopping. But yeah, yesterday I cooked tilapia broccoli, which I'm the only one that like broccoli. So I made green beans for Granny and Gavin. So they ate that and today I'm making, I really don't even know what it's called. My mom used to make it a lot and I used to like it, but we never had a name for it. It's just like beef stew, but we put tomatoes, okra, and corn in it. And to me it's really good. Huh? Goulash? No, it's not goulash and it's not succotash. I don't know what it's called. Cause I mean, I get, I don't know. Either way, <laughs> just wanted to say, hey, because I was gonna take y'all with me, but I'm like, I go to Strack and Vance Hill and Walmart in every single vlog, it seemed like, so we're not even gonna do all of that. But, um, yeah, I don't even really know what we need to talk about. I think I told y'all, did I show y'all this book we got? So, me and Gavin went to Five Below, and we got this book called Me, You, Us, and it's a book to fill out together. So, while he's here, we've been filling out this book, and so, like, the other day, I'm gonna show y'all. So, the other day, we did this, the perfect team name for us. I put the adjective, I said, I'm gonna pick the adjective, <laughs> you pick the noun, and we came with the spicy tamales. Um... If a genie gave us three wishes, we filled that out. Um, oh, the story of how we met. <laughs> but we're brother and sister, so yeah. But it's like kind of cool because it's like different stuff. Oh, we could do this one. Hashtags about you and me. Oh. Um, yeah, let's do these two. So yeah. He leaves when next week really so we pretty much only got one more week together so we're gonna try to fill out as many as we can but i'm pretty sure he'll be back for christmas so we'll also be able to fill some stuff out around that time but yeah just want to check in let y'all know what was up granny went to church yeah i do bible study all day i will go to bible study all day because it's wednesday at six o'clock what's well, wednesday at 6 30. we leave the house at six o'clock but going to church and being there at nine o'clock in the morning is a stretch it is and i don't even be staying up all night really because i think last night i went to sleep at like 11 o'clock i ain't been going out y'all ain't seen me go out with my friends i ain't been going out with my friends <laughs> I just been chilling, but it's something about going to church that early, like, and I get it. Everybody's like, but you get up, you go to church, and before noon, you home, whatever. I get it, but y'all, it's the getting up part. But anyways, me and Gavin about to fill out this book, and I'll talk to y'all later. Hey, y'all. So, since we last talked, I then did so much, because it's 5 o'clock now, 
but your girl got an order and i was like let me go ahead and package this up and ship this off asap so i literally y'all this is how good i am <laughs> i don't play about y'all money y'all shop with missy aesthetics please believe i'm gonna ship y'all stuff out asap i got the order had it packaged shipped label on everything in less than 15 minutes i did sit around the house because i was debating on if i wanted to take it to the post office tonight or not but i was like you know what i'm gonna take it to the post office so i don't have to worry about it tomorrow and i'm gonna stop at a store i'm gonna go to the store after i go to the post office so i can look at a few things but i just want to say oops my bad y'all they're um redoing the streets on my street <laughs> So it'd be like a little bit of traffic on the corner. But this package is going all the way to South Carolina. So I'm so grateful for each and every one of y'all that supports me and Missy Aesthetics. If you have not shopped with me, please go to missyaesthetics.com and shop with me. I sell the best body butters, body oils, body scrubs, and body creams. Okay? And if you can't purchase, if you could just tell a friend about my product, that would be amazing. Or if you are in the Northwest Indiana or Chicagoland area and want to get a pedicure or a facial, come see me. But it's just so crazy. Like, God is just so good. And it's like I keep telling God, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And even with me thanking him, I feel like I'm not even doing enough. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I'm just so grateful that he gives me this platform and allows me to tell the few people that watch me and enjoy my vlogs how good God is and I think y'all watch me because y'all know even though I be acting a fool sometimes y'all know that I know that we know together that God is real good <laughs> I'm playing but God has just done some great things for me within these past few weeks you know I don't even know if it's appropriate to say cuz I don't really like too many people in my business and Hopefully this is, you know, my job is always telling me like, Tanae, you do a great job here. You have a long runway at this job. Like, we love your attitude. We love your personality. We love the hard work you put in. And I'm like, well shoot, y'all don't be acting like, and I for real, I for real was like, sometimes y'all don't act like it, you know? And I be telling them like, I don't like this about the job. I'm like this about the job. And sometimes I feel like they don't be listening and I'm, grateful that I've been uncomfortable at this job and I'm grateful that I have a job for sure but I'm grateful that God has allowed me to be uncomfortable because it's allowed me to look into other things like becoming a nurse and getting serious about my business but I say all that to say talking to y'all the owners the presidents and the, <laughs> the big people okay the big leads I've been telling them like I'm not happy I'm just being real I'm not happy and I got a raise <laughs> <laughs> and I don't know if I got the raise to shut me up, but I'm just so grateful for it because I had just been telling myself like, dang, low key, if I didn't get this car, I would have a little bit of extra shopping money. And something just told me to look at my, my employee account and I got a raise. I was like, dang, God, that is crazy. That is crazy. And I'm thanking God for just like the unexpected blessings. I'm thanking God for the protection and just all that he's been doing because I just be thinking like, dang, I just be sitting here chilling, running my mouth and I'm here. Just I don't, It's just so many things that we take for granted, like waking up every day, being able to move, talk, walk, pray, laugh, love, all that. You know what I'm saying? And I think we take, I take it for granted. And I just, I was just telling God, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for all that you've been doing. Blessing me, blessing people around me pouring into me so I could pour into others and boom I got that order and I was like shout out to you big G-O-D for looking out for me but um I'm not going to make this video much longer than what it needs to be because I just be running my mouth y'all and I know y'all be sick of me I'm sorry but I love every single one of y'all who loves me if you haven't already please give me a thumbs up like this video if you can leave a comment because I love when y'all talk to me y'all know I love to talk back and if you've made it to this part of the video and you are not subscribed baby 
subscribe to the channel because you obviously love it here. <laughs> subscribe so you never miss out on another video. But until next time, my beautiful people, stay beautiful, be blessed, and I'll catch y'all in the next one.